This uh, video is about congenital trigger thumbs in twins mirror image pathology. I am Dr. Anil Kumar, consultant, uh, specialist orthopedic surgeon in Trinidad and Tobago. These are the, uh, some of the clinical pictures of the twins. Uh, they, are, they are two and a half years old at presentation. Uh, male twins presented at the same time with fixed flexion deformity since birth of the left thumb in the first twin and then fixed flexion deformity of the right thumb in the second twin. This is an extremely rare mirror image congenital trigger thumb presentation in twins. This is operation technique of a release of right thumb congenital trigger thumb in the second twin patient. This is done under general anesthesia with a uh, penrose drain applied to the form. A transverse skin incision made along the um, palmar proximal skin crease of the thumb. The skin incision is made carefully with, with very little pressure to prevent any injury to the digital nerves. As the babies have very thin palmar subcutaneous tissue, subcutaneous, very thin palmar subcutaneous fat. This is carefully deepened and muscular uh, artery forces tip is used to separate the uh, tissue between the skin and the A1 pulley and the skin insertion is extended as necessary. Again, the mosquito tip um, forceps, forceps tips is used to retract the subcutaneous tissues as well as the digital nerves away from the A1 pulley. And skin hooks also can be used to retract the skin as well as the subcutaneous tissues and also to protect the digital nerves as well as the digital arteries. A 15 blade is used to section the A1 pulley vertically along the length of the flexor policies longest tendon. However, the the oblique pulley knee needs to be protected. It should not extend the incision into the A1 oblique pulley to prevent both stringing of the flexor policies longus tendon. And make sure the A1 pulley is completely divided without injuring the digital nerves, neurovascular bundles, as well as the tendon itself. Now you can see the, um, the interphalangeal joint of the thumb is completely passively extended without any restrictions and there is no uh, permanent contracture of the IP joint. So flexor policy longest standard was retracted and tested for complete release of the A1 pulley and uh, tested for the complete excursion of the uh, tendon. The 
so the incision is closed with subcuticular uh, photo monocryl. Simple two interrupted sutures was applied to approximate the skin.